What's going on guys, it's me, Bungeboard21, and welcome to another episode of Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds. Well, sorry, it is Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu Legacy of the Doors Link Evolution, but we should continue on on the Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds storyline, and we are going to do probably about four or five duels, I'm not 100% sure, but the next one we're going to be doing is Super... Super... Super Sensory Shakedown, sorry, I couldn't quite pronounce my English yeah. Soon after the Forged Cup ended, Yusei found himself in another duel against a man claiming to be a Dark Signer. After Yusei defeated his foe, he attempted to question him, but the individual had no memory of what he had just transpired. Just, I can't remember this. The man seemed to be under some sort of mind control. However, this was the moment that Yusei met the journalist Kali Kamoni. Uh, sorry. Hi, I'm Carly Kami, and I was hoping you'd tell me what it's like to be the first amateur to take on Domino City's new champ. And what happens here with this freaky dude in the kooky, in the hood, hey, do you hear, Sovers? Who's called security? We better get out of here before we start asking questions. But 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 the interview, we'll finish it later. Later on, you see man up with Rex Goodwin to find answers about the Dark Signers. You say, the time has come for me to tell you the truth. Why don't we start with this mark? That is the mark of the Crimson Dragon. It belongs to those who protect our world from the darkness. This darkness is dangerous. It can take on many forms, even those of your friends. But you will know their identities for they will have the mark of the shadows mark of the shadows you must mean the dark signers just as you were chosen to protect the light they chose to protect the darkness they will do they will stop at nothing to annihilate you to increase their strength that absorb human souls even those even those of the innocent you and your friends must combine your strength and defeat the dark signers and if we can't oh, i forgot to read what the rest said if that's if that should happen, well, you've already seen a glimpse of our fate. After talking with Goodwin, you say was dispatched to satellite in order to seek out the Dark Signers. That's when he met an old friend. Hey, you say, good to see you, Crow. Have you, what have you been up to? You know me, still fighting the good fight, robbing the rich to feed the poor. You know that, <laughs> and he does, and he does do that, Crow. And Crow was a fantastic character in 5Ds. I think a lot of people loved him as a fan favorite. So I heard that you're some big shop shoot champion now. Yeah, something like that. Crow, why are the streets so deserted? These creepy cats have been coming around lately. They spot these wacky takings trying to round up fellows. I better look into this. Before too long, Crow and Yusei both become face to face with a dark signer. You say, and his bird brain friend. Kalen Kiza? Is that really you? I thought you were gone forever. Wrong, you say, and while I was away, I made some new friends. I believe you've already dealed one of the Anisons. You mean the Dark Signer? You're on your side, but you're one of our friends. Once your friend, yes, but now your enemy. Now get ready for the duel of your life. He's a dark signer. This is what Goodwin was talking about when he said the dark signers may come in the form of a friend. During the duel, Kanli summoned Earthbound and Walter Kapali Apu, and the creature absorbs human souls throughout the area. Kalen then used this monster to defeat Yusei. Yusei's friend immediately rushed to Yusei's side. Oh, yeah, Lusei. I think this was Yusei's first loss besides Jack Atlas, which it was surprised me. I was just like, what the hell? I was just like, what the hell happened? Meanwhile, Luna and Leo discuss their next move to help stop the Dark Signers. Since we fight evil, that means we're superheroes, and superheroes are always supposed to stick together. That's like their most important thing. I think their superpowers are most important. Anyway, you're absolutely right, Leo. Let's stick together right here in this in this nice cozy mansion. What about Kaiza? He may be a he may be a signer, but that doesn't mean we can trust her. She's part of the Weirdo Academy movement. That's all we got the physics. Their main objective is to train duelists to inflict real damage. But Akiza would never really want to hurt people. Who knows? I say we stay as far as we possibly can. Or what have it said? But Yangi agreed that our heroes got to stick together. What if she needs our help? Or what if Yusei is in trouble and we need Akiza's deck? as backup there's a million reasons why it's a good idea meanwhile leo luna bolt and tenzin travel to academy movement headquarters to get help from akiza you want to see akiza she's awfully busy what's so incredibly important that you've come all this way here she's 
she has the mark of a dragon. That means she's a superhero. Luna and me are superheroes too. We're going to help our friend Yusei and fight the Dark Signers and save the whole city. I've been monitoring some strange occurrence lately myself. I would love to help you. You would. My academy movement represents all that is good. I promise that I'll do everything to stop your threat. All right. Thank you. Now, if you excuse me, I've got to get a keyser. Unfortunately, in the visit was a trap set up by Saya. His attention was to test Leo's ability to find out if they were similar to Luna's. Where's Luna? Where am I? Why am I chained up with Gizu on my hand? That hat detects talented sinkful powers. Assuming that you may have any. Lately, what? Let him what? You said you were going to get a keys and help us fight the Dark Signers. I will make society powerful. They discriminated and treated pigs as shut out times. What are you going to do? Take my brain or something? Of course not. You're here to take a test to see if you have the power of the psychic duelist. Ikiza was just a preview. I have dozens more physics duelists all at my command. Physics can do incredible things with their minds. Does that mean Ikiza is going to help you get even? But she's supposed to be a hero. A hero? She doesn't even know what I'm really doing here. Now, why do you say we start this test? Sorry, I just want to say this right now. I might have to put my light away just for a bit. My eye is getting a bit painful. So I'm so sorry if I'm just seeing a bit dark right now. Sorry. My god, my... Like, my left side's a bit fine. It's just I'm in a bit of a small room. That's the thing. So, that's a bit irritating. So sorry about if I had to put that away. Oh, God, my face. Oh, and it's kind of obvious he won this duel. But, um... Mm. I'm just going to play it safe, actually. Yeah, I'll just play it safe for now. And just really end my turn. Okay, right. Oh, God, it's got some attack points. I'm fine with that. Uh, yep, I knew it. Right, obviously, I'm just going to quickly activate MST. If it's trap, I can't still be activated. Thank God, but... Yeah, oh, okay, you've set a quip spell. That's a bit interesting for me. I'm obviously, I'm going to do that. That is what I'm obviously going to do. I'm going to pay 800 just to summon uh, any physics monster from my hand. So that is what I'm going to do. Just summon you for now. And then, obviously, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to normal summon Physic Jammer Jumper. But, uh, I don't quite have it right now. But what I can do is I could use this effect. I thought I can sink off, for God's sake. What is this extra deck? Ah, oh, I remember this monster. I think I had a high rarity for this. I'm not 100% sure. I can't quite remember. What I'm going to do is I am going to use this effect of my monster just to remove play Physics. Just to gain some strength. And then just go for some attacking. Oh, I don't know why I summoned Physic Jumper in attack mode. That was stupid of me. I shouldn't have kept in defense mode. So I really should have. Also, I'm, I had a Lucas A drink with me and I just put it behind me. Hold on. Yeah, sorry about that. But Okay, so it seems like uh, Leo. Sorry, I couldn't pronounce that properly. Leo's playing up, trying to play it safe. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to switch that monster to defense. Oh, yeah, my, that monster still keeps 2,000 attack points, which is not bad. So that's quite impressive. Right, let's just do an attack. And then just go for a direct attack, so that's going to be even more fun. God, sorry. Oh, I'm sorry if the if my face is a bit dark, but it just helps me a bit. Um, Leo hasn't done much, to be honest. I thought she was going to... I was going to say she. I thought he was going to do something quite strong. I'll keep you in the fence. Oh, if it, it's not strong enough what I thought it was going to be. Oh, well. But let's do some attacking for now. Oh, 
I love the fact as well that if you see on the front cover the Morphtronic monster, that picture at the front is basically his attack mode position, or his defense mode position. It basically comes to the look of that in the background. I think that's what happened in the anime, if I'm correct. Okay. Who are you going to attack? I uh, thought so. Oh, well. Oh, God. Wait, why did you not do that during your f main phase one? Oh, God. That's not good. But. Yeah, I've better use that monster's effect quickly. So I can't really have um, this. So if I just do this effect, pay a thousand, I'm going to take control of that one. But I'm going to destroy this one on purpose. So, yeah. That's what I'm going to do. But what I'm also going to do, I was going to do something on purpose also. So, this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to get these two to attack each other for now. That's good. And then this monster will attack that one. But since it's my original monster, its effect should go off. Yes, I can use its effect. That's brilliant. Ah, oh, this one. This monster, I think it was put on the ban list. It's just so obvious right now. What you can see is so good. Oh, yeah, that card had had it um, censored. Like, you know, its hand, I'm not going to obviously do the gesture, but its hand had all the fingers, obviously, for a little, uh, some sort of um, quote. But, yeah, that just got removed. I didn't realize that at first until I found out it got censored, which is a bit odd. But, oh, well. Uh, what did I set? Oh, yeah, Call of the Haunted. I forgot what my set card was. <laughs> Uh, Leo's going to play it so I can see why he would do that for safety. Uh, you know what? That's not a bad idea. We're going to use MST on your field spell. Oh, God. No, hold on. What I'm going to do, actually, is we're going to build up my defense a bit. So let's just bring back um, this because I'm obviously going to do what you're going to probably expect a synchro summon. Then I'll just summon this monster. Why can't I do a synchro? <sighs> Balls it up again, haven't I? I have bloody balls it up yet again. But that's fine, because I've got a stupid idea I can do. We'll just end the duel like that for now. Oh, well. Oh, I've missed the levels. Sorry, Luna. It looks like the boy isn't special after all. At least I still have the girl. Oh, God, yeah, he does. Uh, dig in deeper. Uh, reporter Carly Cumming was on the trial to find out what exactly the Crimson Dragon was. Her f search... Her search lead her to sneak into a kind of Arcade Movement headquarters where she be where she was face to face with Saya, the bloke who just dueled. Yeah. These files prove Academy Movement isn't as innocent as they claim to be. Well, well, a little mouse. Oh, yeah. I forgot to say, in the dub, it's different. But in the sub, it was a lot more terrifying. You should be more careful. You shouldn't go scrambling where there could be traps. Now that you've seen what you've seen, I can't let you leave. But it is interested of good sport. Allow me to at least give you a fighting chance. So you can try to run or you can duel me. What do you say? Bring it on. You should have tried to run. Oh, this is getting a bit sad. Oh, wait, that's a new support. That's a support for Buster Blider. It, it has, as you can see, it gains a thousand attack for every dragon monster. And also, I think it does piercing damage if it attacks a dragon. So, that's quite good. Also, if I'm correct, yet again, it makes all your opponent's dragon type monsters go to defense mode. Oh, yeah, again, another broken spell card. At least you can't do anything. 
I'm not playing any jokes. I literally can't summon a monster right now. Because it will get removed from play during the end phase of the turn this card was activated. Great. Oh yeah, that card, that field spell is so annoying. Oh, hello. That's fine by me, so I'm going to use this quickly. Uh, who do I want to summon quick? Or oh, who's strong? Who's strong? By the way, this monster is a normal summon. It's it's differently summoned, so that's not bad. I'm just going to get rid of the field spell. And I have another copy. And it doesn't say once per turn. So that's quite also an interesting thing to say. Destroy that face down. Just get rid of it. Obviously, you have to pay a thousand for it. But then I'm just going to do an att attack. Just for safety. But now, but unfortunately, my monster is going to get sent to the gravity because of the equip spell. Oh, sorry, you got removed from play. Need to read these cards carefully. Great, she has another field spell. And she can't bring back her monster because it was removed from play. Fortunately, Lady Fire, oh, that's going to become more strong when it comes back. That's not good. I have to summon it, but then it's going to get removed from play. That's the problem. That's fine by me. I'll just end my turn for now. This is going to be quite hard. At least she's only got two more copies. Well, she's only got one more copy left. That one's been active. Then there's one in the graveyard. There's probably one somewhere in her deck. Oh, hello. Okay. Yeah, it's, a, it's Carly's deck, Fortune Ladies. I've got to be very careful what I'm doing. Oh, that's fine, actually, because I can just do this quickly. I'm going to have to get rid of the field spell because you can't break that other monster back, so that's good. It was a cost of a 1,000 life points. I'm just going to keep teleport in my hand for now. Yeah, with the, with the, with the psychic, the physic. Oh, my. It's physic. Not psychic. Physic. That is the type of archetype. Psychic monsters, you mostly pay life points to you, you do something, and then the synchros literally gain you. Oh my, oh my god, I've mispronounced that so many times. I've mispronounced that word so many times. I can't believe that. I'm so sorry if I sound stupid. Great, right, I have nothing I can do except for setting a card. I'm so sorry if I've mispronounced it. That, that, that oh my, I've pronounced the word incorrectly. It's so stupid. Oh, I could have done some attacking. I would have taken a thousand, but oh well. Actually, yeah, I'll do this. Hold on. I'll just summon you for now. And obviously get rid of the fire one. So that's all I'm going to do. Just go for an attack. Oh, great. Oh, great. Dun, dun, dun. That's not good. Trap card lets it bring itself back. I was, was going to say... Um, I should probably would have lost the door, but thanks to the field spell, 
it's um, a bit different for now. So yeah, when a monster is normal summon, it just gets removed or played, then it comes back. That's the field spell spin up. But that's a final one. That's the thing. So I've got to be really careful here. Alright, let's see what I can do here. So I've got to really think what I can do. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's gonna get it's gonna get removed from play since you've normal summoned it. I'm fine with that. Obviously, I'll use the monster's effect, and I believe I'll also use one of my trap cards. So that'll be good. Well, actually, I can use both. Actually, let's do that just to get my life points back up by a lot. Let's see. Actually, that's going to be a good one because I need to increase that monster's attack points by a lot. Yep, good. That's actually good for now. Hold on. I'm going to do some just to summon you. Then I'm just going to summon you. And then obviously I'm going to use your effect quite a lot. Oh, um, I forgot about the field spell. <clears throat> I forgot about the field spell. No! That's not good. That's not good. I've ballsed it up. Oh, I can't believe I've ballsed it up and I've wasted the trap card. Ah, oh, it's GG. I'm just gonna. Oh, for God's sake. I absolutely hate when I balls up because I can't read something properly. Better hand. This is a better hand. Oh my God, it literally is. Now, I'm going to show you why this um, psychic, f no, physic or psych. Oh, what, what is the word? Psychic. I, I can't remember. I can't remember already. But basically, this monster is just so good. Right, she's activated that now. I'm very scared. Okay, she plays it safe for now. And she has Swords of Inner Light. What the hell? My god, come on. Oh, finally. That's not bad, actually. I'm just going to end my turn for now, since there's nothing else I can do. Ah, I should have known you were going to summon someone powerful, but it's going to get removed from play. Someone this one. I know it's gonna get removed from play, but I'm fine with that. I'm just gonna end my turn. I think sword should be gone now. No, one more turn, sorry. Oh, this is so irritating. I don't think there's a field spell for my deck. I don't think um Sally has ever used a field spell for this. I don't think so. When he dueled in five Ds. Oh, what's the chain? Oh my god, are you serious? Come off it. Oh. I'm gonna bring you back there. Oh, I've got more cards in the extra deck this time. Thank you. Oh, I could really use that card, actually. I really could. That is what I'm going to do. 
Just gonna have my turn. Swords is now gone, thank god. Thank god that gets removed from play. That's good, that's good. Obviously, I'm going to use that monster's effect. Hi, Darcy. Just going to play it quite safely. Obviously, I have to use both of them. If it's effect twice, just protect my life points. Let's see, draw. And now I'm going to summon this. I've got to call it right. That's literally what I've got to do. I'm going to go with Monster. I just really have to get the right card for this. Actually, no, I'll save that for later. But I can also Synchro again. Pick a random card. Uh, we'll go with Monster. Oh, what a guess. What an absolute guess that was. But what can I Synchro Summon? Is it that level 8? Yeah, it's that level 8. Obviously, I am going to summon this monster. Unfortunately, it is going to get removed from play. I am perfectly fine with that. But actually, what I might do is actually I might return them all back to my deck and then draw three. Actually, that's actually not a bad idea. I'd better quickly do that. Let me draw two, sorry. Now for some attacking. Let's go. I've just destroyed that. I am going to have to literally destroy both of these monsters. I just have to. Oh, thank God for that. I'm so glad I called it right. L literally so happy I've called it right. <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, Wait, what's happening? What the hell? what is going on god I'm getting so confused what's happening <laughs> I literally am oh yeah I forgot I could bring back my monster uh, first of all I am going to use this monster's effect I'm going to vote monster again let's go monster oh my god that was a spell card god damn it don't have enough in the graveyard. Oh, no. Oh, this deck is so pathetic it is. Oh. Sorry, not being funny. This deck's actually terrible. God, I'm going to have to use this effect quickly. Let's do some attacking. Oh. Come on, please be careful. Oh, I keep losing 400. It's not much, but it will probably mean a lot near the end. Obviously, I'm going to use my trap card. Why not? Because it makes perfect sense to use it. No! Let's do it. Oh, thank God for that. Since I normal summon a monster, I should get it back if I'm correct. So let's say if I'm correct on that. Yep, I am correct. Just gonna set a monster for now. Obviously, what I'm gonna do is I'm literally gonna increase the attack points yet again, just in case. And just go for some attacking. Darcy! 
So I don't know what my dog was doing then. I'm just gonna have my turn for now. Oh, this is so time. We've hit 30 minutes on this, so that's a time. Darcy, come up. Sorry, my dog's scraping the floor. Right, I just need to focus here what I can do next. So let me see if I draw. It's not a bad idea, actually. I'll just keep that active for now. And then I'm just going to do some attacking for now. So let's go. Ooh. Now I'm in the lead. And it's been 15 turns, which is ridiculous. So this is now turn 16. Ooh. Please be full of God. Be careful. Actually, me. That's not a bad idea. Hold on. I am going to do is I am going to do a uh, synchro summon for another one of this. Yep, there we go. Oh my gosh. Just for safety. It's just for safety. For the love of God. So let's do this. I'm probably going to pick monster again. But uh, she does have a field spell. That's the thing. But I'm going to go with monster. What a guess. Brilliant. Unfortunately, when I do summon you, you're going to get removed from play, which is very irritating. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some attacking. So let's go. Oh, for God's sake, that just has enough defense. Synchro will attack you now. Oh, this is so hard. It literally is. Oh, thank God that it's a tap point to get, it gets a thousand attack until my next turn. Oh yeah, first of all, future vision, I get my monster back. Then obviously I'm going to do another gamble. Uh, it can't be a monster because she didn't summon a monster, so I'm going to go with spell. Oh, okay. Didn't think of that, so let me just set a monster defense. Uh, I don't know if I have enough strength. It's 2600 plus. No, I should have enough attack points to finish her off. I should have enough, so that's good. So 1400 and then 2400 compared to 2000. I should be fine. There we go. Finally, we defeat that tool. You won't get away with this. Sector security will come looking for me. Except security can touch us, not as long as I know the truth about Goodwin. And what truth would that be? Oh yeah, Carly loses her glasses. Dara de Gurin is from the satellite sector, and that, my dear, it's the last, it's the least of his secrets. I wonder what else he's hiding. Night, night, little mouse. Night, night, little mouse. Ha 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 ha. I know Carly was screaming, Carly was going, ah! Sorry, she was screaming. My bad. I made a mistake on that. Mark of the monkey. <laughs> As Carly fell from the Academy Movement Building, she was abandoned by Purple Mist and vanished. In the, the, the sub version, they didn't realize this. She she literally fell off the building, dead. That's literally what happened in this. It was she just fell into some smoke, and literally in the sub, this is this is something I didn't quite like. There was someone else that got caught in the dub, which I respect. I understand that. Is that in that she's fell and then she was just like in there and i think this is what happened next soon afterwards the earth began to quake carly reappeared as a dark signer and that's what did happen you get out of my building but i'm here to ask you for a rematch sire i must be seeing things is that you carly but you fell the dark signers are actually recruiting duelists to join their causes and they've chosen yours truly and that's bad news for you saya and carly began a shadow duel as and a series of quite continued to hit our academy movement tower Saya was defeated by a dark sign of carly and seemingly fell to his doom from a top academy headquarters during the battle earthquake about mortal alisa pieces was summoned and began to destroy the entire building wait why did they not show this duel i swear two duels were going off at the same time 
Fortunately, Leo, Luna, Bolt, and Chinese use this opportunity to escape Academy Headquarters. Luna, how did you guys find me? This is the eighth door, Bolt, that we've knocked in. I break. I need to break this glass to get to Leo. Leo, you're right. Where's Luna? Is she okay? I'm right in front of you, Leo. I'm so glad you're safe. It's not like I'm helpless without you. So, uh, what am I doing in this room? I don't know, but let's not talk about that right now. Meaning, let's get out of here. Akiza managed to escape the collapsing building with the rest of Yusei's friends, and the Earthbound Immortal vanished along with the Dark Sino. Elsewhere in New Domino City, a newly detained Gregory received a surprising rescue. Her? Huh? Who are you? My name is Dervak. I know that Goodwin did to you, Gregory, to your village. I know you're angry, and I know you still want revenge. I can help you with that revenge. Come with me. Meanwhile, you say Fudo and the rest of the signers met with Goodwin to discuss recent events. Let me give you a history lesson. Thousands of years ago, a huge, far was a, a huge war was fought, where the Crimson Dragon defeated the Army of Shadows. Afraid that the shadows would one day return to the new world, the Crimson Dragon locked them underground. Magic symbols were carved into the earth, trapping their entities for millennium. In time, the shadows were forgotten and prisoners began a tourist destruction known as the Nasir Lines. But the shadows were willing to stay defeated. They want revenge, which they are now getting the help of the Dark Signers. I believe some of you have already experienced the Dark Signers, Danshree's monsters firsthand. You mean the Earthbound Immortals? Yes, their strength is staggering, for they contain the very power of the Army of Shadows. We get it, they are bad. Let's take them out. Our task goes far beyond beating an enemy. It's a rescue operation for all those poor people who have been corrupted by the power of darkness. After talking with Goodwin, the designer teams headed into satellite in order to stop the Dark Signers. The Signer team dark the, the Dark the Signer team split up, each setting out to battle a different Dark Signer, each with their own motivations. The Dark Signer devout has taken ancient fairy dragon and was kept it from Luna. In an attempt to find and rescue her ancient fairy dragon, Luna transported to the spirit world. By the way, ancient fairy dragon was quite good at first, but that card's banned. It's so broken now in the meta rule, just to give you a heads up. While Leo searched for Luna, he came across Devalia and was pulled into a duel against a Dark Signer. Who are you? You're not a Signer. What are you doing here? I'm here to duel you. That is if you are thinking strong enough to take me on. Is this some kind of joke? Where's the little girl? Why isn't she here? I told her to come. Well, she's busy. You're going to have to duel me instead, mister. I may not be a signer, but that doesn't mean that I can't rock a deck. I applaud your enthusiasm, but I'm afraid that you simply do not have enough power to match me, boy. If you insist on being destroyed, so can so so be it. Yeah, and this is when it gets like... I think towards after all the signers, uh, season one ends. By the way, I think season one had 70 episodes, which is very long. But I don't know if that was the longest season for episodes for Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm not sure there was another season or whatever. I do apologize. Just going to obviously do a little gambling game with um, Morphtronic self on. <laughs> Uh, four, right. No. No, that's a good quick. That's a good quick play spell. Okay, thank God for that. Oh, thank God for that. No, it crashed. The game crashed as I it <laughs> didn't move. Are you serious? Oh my god, no. I just love doing the night. It's by the way, with both Analog 6 on Nintendo Switch. I he hasn't I don't know, it's it's um the 13th right now, which is only 12 days for Christmas and we're halfway. And I, I just hope I am gonna get some Nintendo Switch games. Obviously Smash is one of them. Oh, I'm so sorry this has just crashed. Uh yeah, story. I nearly clicked the wrong one. Oh, excuse me. Oh my god, sorry about that. Uh, Devac, I think he has a monkey deck. Or gorilla, sorry. I forgot what type of deck he has. He's also a yellow signer, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to duel each one. Is 
It's an interesting field spell. It's just reading its effects. How have I got this banned cards, Yu Gi Oh? Whatever. No, I need a, I need a level seven. Gadget Huller. I forgot. I forgot what Huller is. I'm probably going to have to use this because I need to take the risk and hopefully summon something good. So that's what I'm going to do. So let's see. If we roll a six, I'll be okay. It's a three. Right. Um, another cell phone. Uh, uh, more something like Scorpion. What do you call it? Or Gadget. I don't know if I can summon that one. Can I? No, I can't summon. I need to roll a six for that. I'm just going to summon this for now. So let's do that. Oh, it becomes level four. Uh, what's this? I'm just going to have my turn. If I could just summon a level three monster, that's not a tuna. This would be good. Piercing damage. Right. Right. Well, that's fine. I can summon this monster now. But first, I am going to obviously use Morphtronic Cell Phone's effect. So let's give it a go. Uh, it's only a two for God's sake. Please, please, please. Something good. <laughs> I can't even summon you. Oh, what? I can. I'm so confused how this works. Oh. Okay, that's interesting. So what I am going to do is I am going to tribute my monster to summon this one. Obviously, I'm just going to discard only a minimum of one for now. So that'll be enough. I think I can attack twice. That's not bad. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some attacking. Then also I'm going to get rid of this monster, Moja. I think my brother loved that card when we were little. If I am correct, I'm not 100% sure. But then I'm going to attack your set monster and it's another one. <laughs> well, I'm just going to end my turn for now. I'm saying it no, saying it wrong. Uh. Oh, you have to attack, otherwise it's destroyed. But thank God I've got this equip spell card to help me with it, so I'll take control of your monster. But he's going to get a thousand life points each turn. Then I'm just going to summon this one, and I'm just going to activate this for now. I can attack twice, so let's give this all we can for now. We're just going to do a ton of attack. I don't know if this will finish him off, actually. No, I don't want to do the numbers. We'll just do some attacking and find out. And then Berzik Gorilla has to attack. No, I just want to finish it off. Oh well, that's fine by me. We're doing good with some attacking. I could have summoned I could have summoned that and just finished off the duel. Oh my god, I didn't think of that. But I am gonna summon Power Tool Dragon. And I'm obviously I'm gonna do it with that monster because I do not want. It, I don't want to keep playing my opponent a thousand life points. Obviously, I'm going to summon the defense mode because it's better. Uh, do I get an animation? Because it is one of the... Ah, oh, for God's sake. But I'm going to use the gamble effect. So, let's see. Let's see. Yep, let's do this. So, I basically choose three equipped spell cards. Uh, the opponent picks one randomly and then I equip it. Right. 
Well, that's brilliant. That's actually brilliant right now. So I can equip it onto my monster. Leave it from there for now. So what's the vac got? It's just gonna set a monster. Okay. I'm fine with that. So let's see. Obviously I'm gonna use that monster's effect yet again. some random equip spell cards for now. That'd be good if I got another one of that. Oh, okay, I'm fine with this. Just want to read what it does. Oh, that's good. Enough for me. I'm going to equip it to my synchro. Switch it to attack mode and then let's do some attacking. So here we go. Ah, oh, brilliant. I've won this duel. Attack my opponent directly with Power Tool Dragon. Also, I think Power Tool Dragon was also another card I had first from a tin. Also, if I'm correct. Luna returned from the spirit world and regained Ancient Fairy Dragon with Leo and Luna's combined power. They were able to defeat the Devak. This is totally happy ending moment. Expect this isn't the ending. Leo, you were finally gr you were really great. <laughs> Sniff. You cry, baby. Oh, as he thought he was gonna die. It was quite scary at the same time. A whale of a rock. Oh my god. This is this is a true story, but I'll tell you at the end of the duel. After Vic was defeated in the Shadow Duel, Gregor appeared as the new Dark Signer. He set out to battle Yusei, but he found one of Yusei's old friends instead. Got to get out of my way. Sorry, pal, but you're not going anywhere. I'm looking for you, say. Well, you found Crow, and you're not going anywhere while we duel. You're challenging me? Great, really? Get really, get real. You're not a signer. The only thing that matters is your um, dark signer, and that means you're going to pay for what you did. Your giant monster and your freaky dark frog have taken everyone from satellite including your orphans I was taken care of. They were just innocent kids. They didn't do anything to you, but I guess that's how you guys operate. Well, not anymore, pal. I'm going to put a stop to you. Since you're so determined to destroy yourself, I'll oblige you. And I'll tell you... No, I'll tell you after the duel. It's actually really interesting about Crow, about this moment, and I think it's... It was, it was changed at the last minute. I'm, that's all I can really say, but I'll tell you at the end of the duel. But, God... I'm just glad it didn't happen and it got changed at the end, but I'll tell you at the end, but it might be obvious. And I'm not sure this will be the last duel, so I'm coming up to about, about like 12 minutes left, so yeah. I've got to be careful. Oh great, my iPad was there. What is it? Oh, just Clash of Clans. Oh, I don't like this is going. Hold on. I really need to add this one because the effect of my continuous spell card can go off. I don't want to use MST for now. Oops. I did not mean to fart. I keep doing it again. It's not a bad effect, actually. Then, obviously, I am going to summon this bad boy to the field. Gale. And also, he can half my monster's attack points. So that's going to be good. Should we show me my extra deck here quickly? I know this... F yeah, that's what I thought. But what I am going to do is I'm going to do some attacking. So let's go. I'm not going to also use my equip spell. Are you going to summon... Okay, thought you were going to summon that. Well, I'm sorry to say, but it's going to get destroyed. And then what I'm going to do next, I am going to perform a Synchro Summon for now. So let's do this. Woohoo! So that's going to be good. Let's 
got not a bad effect actually. Your back wing monsters were a fan favourite during five days. It was incredible. Oh great, yes, swords with being light. Whatever. I'm obviously I'm gonna use MST on it. So let's draw and quickly use Mystical Space Typhoon. This guy used to be a one, but like since not many people did use it, it got put to a three and you don't still really see it. Yeah, we're going to normal summon it without tribute, and then my continuous spell card's going to go off. So that's good. But also want to change that monster's bow position, also. <laughs> but I think black. But I think that um, spell card was also limited, also. Alright, this is a good one to have. Ooh, let's go. Nice. I'm going to hold on to Tribute Dooms just in case. But let's do some attacking for now. Boom. Just like that. Ooh. It's fine to actually use Black... I don't think I've really used Black Wings. Maybe from Dual Links. But I don't know where else I've really um, used it from. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well, indeed. Doing quite well in the moment. That's pretty good. It's fine because this monster does piercing damage. I'm just going to keep it from there, what I've got. Just in case. Oh, that's not good. And here comes the end. Dun, dun, dun. Now there's one that's doing like five minutes. <laughs> oh, well. During the duel, Gregory realized his enemy wasn't truly the signers of Goodwin. Gregory attempted to forfeit the duel, but the power of the shadows would not allow him. After the battle was won, Gregory was gravely injured while caving crow from collapsed debris. Why did you risk your life for me? Because you risked yours so that my family and friends could return to their homeland. Gregor, you must continue to fight the Dark Signers. Stay strong and save your family. You can't count you can count on me, Gregory. I'm gonna tell you this the thing that happened. Um that was his ace monster, and I think there's also another monster to use. Basically, in this duel, if I'm correct, Crow was supposed to lose and then become the Dark Signer. And then I think it was Yusei who defeats Crow and then he dies for her. But then since Black Winds became such a fan favourite, that's why he never became a Dark Sun. And that's why he kept Crow as a, a lovely character. But I'm not sure what else there was. There was some more stuff behind it, but I can't 100% remember. But yeah, that's literally the true story about it. So yeah, that's quite scary. We're basically over 20% of the story, which is really good to see. So... That's not bad. We've probably got like another four or five episodes of this series to do, but hey, anyway, you guys, I do want to say thank you all very much for watching today's episode. If you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, share with friends, or subscribe to the channel with notifications so my latest videos up. And I do want to say thank you very much for watching today's episode. I'll see you all in the next one. Have a nice day, everyone. Take care and goodbye.